previously on KG Gaming. An alligator literally tried to kill my dog and eat it. Long story short, I killed that alligator. But at that moment, I swore I was going to kill every alligator I possibly could. And that brings us to present time. My dog has deceased. He has been killed. Jamal is dead. But I also shot a couple alligators last episode, and we're going to go find those right now. Right over here is both of them. They stinking tried to kill me. They tried to kill my dogs. I stinking gunned them down with the 10 millimeter. Check this one out. A nun harvest. Wonder why? Probably because I shot him eight, nine times because he wouldn't get out the way of my dog. This alligator messed up because he started a stinking war. How much did I make off that? $600 for a stinking alligator? That's like the second alligator I've ever killed in this game ever. And this one's the third. Shot him three times. Blowed him up real nice. He wasn't even going to be a silver, even on a good day. But I tell you what, guys, I don't know if that alligator knew what he was doing whenever he tried to kill my dog, Jamal, but my dog, Jamal, is laying over here dead. We're going on an alligator killing spree in Florida. I'm killing every single alligator I see regardless of size, and we're bringing out the big guns to do so. We ain't messing around this video. I already got my gator call and everything. Let's go get some guns, boys. We're getting rid of the 22. We're getting rid of the 243. We're keeping the 10 millimeter because it's the only thing that kept me alive. We're bringing out the 308 AR. We're bringing out the Ot 6 bolt gun. We're bringing out the red dot. And by golly, if we ain't taking a muzzle loader just to rub it in. Now let's go kill some gators. We're doing this for Jamal. We're doing this for all the little kids that's been eaten by alligators at Disney World. We're doing it for them. <laughs> We just spotted our first gator, boys. It is way over there, about 400 yards, and uh, it's swimming. It's swimming. What do you What do you do about that? I really don't know what to do when they're swimming. I actually don't know if you can even kill them when they're swimming. Oh, he's not swimming no more. He's on land. Oh, now he's running. Now he's resting. Oh, he messed up. Oh, he messed up. 300 something yards. Pulling out the ot six. Are you with me? This is an important shot. This could have been the same alligator that tried to kill Jamal. Here we go. Is he going down? Is his health going down? His health is not going down at all. What in the world? What happened? How did that, how did he not die? You look me in the eyes and tell me how that happened. That was like a perfect shot, was it not? My zero distance was correct. I don't even know what to say right now. I'm speechless, I am. <gasps> no, he just died. He just died. He just popped up. There's another one. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait, Jamal, you're alive. Dude, I thought you died. My gator's stuck out there. Does that mean we have to go get it, I guess? All right, Jamal, we're trekking through the swamp. We gonna go collect our kill. Unfortunately, it got hung up. It didn't float back to us, but that's all right. I know, I'll tell you one thing. I'm getting my I'm getting my AR ready. I was thinking throw down if I have to. We're in gator country. Come on, Jamal, get over here before you get eaten, dude. They already tried to kill you once. Oh my gosh, is that one, is that one, is that one, is that one? That's the one I done killed. Where is it going? I know I didn't run all the way out here just for it to float back over there. Dude, what in the world? My alligator's floating away. I can't go out there. Well, that's sad. All right, let's check out the first gator of the day, boys. He looks like a big one from here. And he's a silver. That's not bad. That's not bad at all. That's kind of crazy, honestly. I have not killed many gators at all. Look at this, huh? Now how you feel, you dog killer. Pretty good. Perfect shot, too. Pretty cool. <laughs> Oh, here, I hear it, I hear it, I hear it, I hear it. There it goes, there it sneaking goes. There's five shots. All five shots landed in the gator. I don't imagine him going much further. This was a 308 after all. Guys, this is basically like rabbit hunting, but for alligators. Like, is this the sh is this really the strategy? In my last video, this was the same way I killed those two alligators we collected in the beginning. But as for this alligator, he looks pretty big. He would probably be oh snap. Uh, well, he'd been a silver, but I also shot him five times. I mean, I emptied the mag on him. Whenever I told you guys I'm here to kill him and to kill them all, I'm not kidding. I'm literally here to kill them and kill them all. I don't care if I get a trophy or not. Although I am looking kind of low on bullets for this AR, so if you see me switching over to this thing or even this thing, you know it's game time because if I have to, I'll sneak and put black powder all over the side of a gator. Point blank if I have to. <laughs> 
Another gator spotted. We're going to blow his hide off, brother. Oh, snap. Is that one? That looks like one, but it ain't. I don't think. We'll shoot it here in a minute, make sure. I was just looking over there and spotted that one right there. 130-something yards. That is going to be so easy for the OT-6. We ain't even using the OT-6. We're using a muzzle loader. This isn't even to kill it. This is to send a message. Eat that, buddy. Dead right there this is a cannon that is a cannon it killed that thing instantly i don't even think i hit the heart maybe i did i don't know now this is a bad machine dude takes about four minutes to reload though my question though is how do I get over there? That's right, sign. Flatlined it. Let's see where I hit it. Oh, it was a neck shot. Neck shot. Hey, well, a neck shot's a good shot. It's all I'm saying. You know what I mean? Sweet. Now, let's move on and let's find another one because we are not stopping anytime soon. <laughs> All right, guys, it is a different day, but I'm still out here with the same mission. Kill every single alligator I possibly can. And I got one in the scope, but it's way out there. But I'm pretty sure it was a big one. I think it was a level five. If this is a level five, and it is as big as I think it is, we're going to mount this thing, and then we're going to go to the trophy lodge and see what kind of mounts we can get for it. These alligators have literally been the hardest thing I've ever hunted in this game, so I want to mount one to have something to remember it by. This has been actually really tough. I think if I get close enough, I'll probably take it out with the 30 out 6 Oh snap, dude. Oh snap, dude. I think it knows I'm here. I think it knows I'm here. All right, I'm gonna just go ahead and get the 308. I think the 308 is my better option. Oh, it's got a red dot on it. It's not a good option. Oh, it's a slug gun. And we're just gonna go for the best. We may have to shoot a running shot here. There it is. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Just get ready to make a shot. Make that shot. Make that shot. Make it count, man. Make it count, man. Or been able to make that count. We should have got a good shot. I think we got a kill shot. Get that 10 mil out just in case. There might be more. But I think that's the one we were looking for. I think that's the big one. It just think it popped up. I think that's the one that killed my dog last episode. Even though somehow I think this is Jamal. I think he actually revived himself. So can't complain. We got two shots in him with the OT6. We should have a perfect score. Sweet. Let's take a second out. Oh, it's a silver. Honestly, that is good enough for me. I only got one shot in him. Ooh, that's not cool. We're actually going to mount him. Now let's not waste any time. Let's just go straight to the trophy lodge. As you can see, I've not actually visited my trophy lodge in quite a long time, but I do have this random looking goat sitting here, which is pretty epic. I got this mule deer here, which is epic. I got this albino turkey, which apparently isn't albino, but it's obviously a white turkey. And then I got this big red deer. Now we need somewhere to put this alligator, but I don't exactly know where to do that like we need a really cool place to put the alligator so let's see no 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 that's not gonna work that is not how you mount an alligator let's look at all the alligator poses oh now that's actually that's actually really cool i'm not liking the head mounts though let's go ahead and remove him let's go find somewhere else we're kind of just exploring the trophy lodge i'm pretty sure that right here yeah we can get a full mount oh that's actually pretty cool right there oh that's really cool that's really cool right there oh that's crazy i think we need to do this one though that way as soon as you walk in you get to see a big old alligator or even like that i think it's really cool i think that's the move and while we're here let's go ahead and place this red fox because it's also a pretty Pretty cool one. I think that's pretty cool right there. That way, as soon as you walk in, you get to see my big mountain goat, then my red fox, and then my alligator. And as for that, this video is actually over. Click right over here if you want to spend 24 hours straight in Africa, or right over here for the previous episode where we tested out the 22 Hornet.